In this video, we are going to talk about Barcelo Occidental Caribe a Hotel in Punta Cana. We arrived at the reception at the Lovey Hotel Hotel. As you can see here, it was almost always super full, especially at check-in, it has a lot of people. Then this was the hotel, we were in block 6. It has 7 blocks, if you are farther away it's better because it's less sound. And here we are inside our room. We had a double room with a pool view, this was our bathroom, it was really clean and neat. And this was our amazing view, it was right into the pool. And if you turn a little bit to the right, you can see actually the ocean, which was amazing. And then here, um, you will have a pool area. The hotel has actually two pools. Uh, it has, well, three, including the kids' pool. But it was really nice, really cozy. Uh, it has bars inside of this pool, which was nice. And it has a lot of chairs around it if you want to tan, it's also really good. This was the second pool we stayed at, and this little part we're in right now, it's like a kiosk, like right in the middle, and you can see there's like kind of a hot tub in the middle, which wasn't really working, but it was nice to have. And this is a nice place if you want to have a little shade. All day long you will have people like doing activities like bingo or like bar or here and they were also like doing Zumba classes like every day I think it was like around 11 a.m. so they were dancing to change dance to change cook they were actually super nice and they will help you whatever you need here is the kids pool uh, you will have to have like grown up with the kids but it was really nice like it was my grand kids pool I had like a tab and like lots of games you can play in it. Um, it which I also find really nice to the right of a kids pool is a trapeze which I was like at first like who would actually use this but then we actually saw some people trying it like every day which was fun like as you can see here people like just went up there and just held the loose bars and jumped which is fun it's, it's nice to have it the gym was almost always empty, I don't know why. Uh, here is the disco, they have one in the hotel. Uh, it has nice music. And now, like, the most important part of the hotel is the beach. It's literally right in front of the beach, you can walk straight to it. It's super wide compared to the hotels nearby, which is nice because it's not crowded. The sand's beautiful, super thin, and it was so clean like every day you can see it like super nice waters my favorite activity always was like walking through the beach just seeing this awesome landscape and like so calm waters were high like really high tides and also like sipping cocktails because there's an open bar that is all inclusive uh, right by the beach reading in sunset was one of my favorite things to do in the world like just look at this clean water, it's amazing. And here I am, literally just walking on the beach as I did every single day I was there because it was amazing. And like just look at this sunset we had like this view almost every day we stayed there it rained like a day or two that we were there but otherwise it was amazing and they set up like this chairs and tables for romantic dinners so I'm just like posing there in a bathing suit which is super cool and just like being grateful for appreciating all this so I hope you like the ocean because it's like the most amazing water is literally like a gateway to paradise here. Here now we are going to do a tour with the restaurant. This is the main restaurant. It's called the El Alcazar restaurant. It's a buffet. For us it was really hard to get a table at the first days because it was so, so full. Then like people went away and this is the breads. They are literally every meal. 
here is like a station for the salads where you can apply like literally everything you want there are a lot of cheeses a lot of veggies and it's really nice they even have sushi at night which i felt it was amazing because i love sushi and everything was like restocked constantly so you wouldn't have to like mind if something was done because they would like literally after it's done or before it is done you get more this is the place that you get to get like your main dinners for example and here's all the food it was almost always you have to do a lot of line like you can see here like this was for the meats but it was relatively fast but you can have like other options it's a buffet it changes every day literally so and every meal so this is what i got like for dinner and this is like all of the options they have for breakfast which i found a lot like pancakes like you can have like your eggs preferred as you want there were sausages like cereals fruits lots of fruits and even like you got some entertainment where while you're there so it was amazing if you want to eat pizza with an amazing view i recommend you going here like during snacks or at lunch you can get like different kinds of pizza and this is the view from up top like literally you can see right in front of the option uh, the pizza that i ordered was the margarita one it wasn't as tasty at least for me but just being there and the view was like the best experience ever and it's really windy so it's nice because Dominican Republic can be actually really hot and if you actually go downstairs of that that's in the second pool you can see like a place where you can find like a lot of snacks it's called Lauren and Stream and like snacks like they had like fries, hot dogs, uh, rice, beans like literally whatever you want like almost every time of day it was open so you can literally run there and snap whatever you wanted which I find it was really useful because you do get hungry there this is a Mexican restaurant we had a really bad experience like service took too long food was like not as tasty and it was little so even though you have to have a reservation I recommend you going to other places this was the other place that we did get a reservation it's called Tokyo the people here were super kind and the service was amazing they seat you like in groups of eight well, you do a reservation then you have to choose one entry and one dessert and then the rest is like tipping jack your eyes waiters do like this amazing show for you like literally they cook right in front of you and it was really good really tasty i do not like we couldn't get any more reservations when we were there reservations for restaurants open on sundays at 7 a.m till 3 p.m we actually arrived on sunday and we only got two reservations the rest of the restaurants i don't know were like closed or didn't have reservations for example the italian restaurant was closed the entire time we were there but like if you can get a reservation to tokyo i would definitely recommend it was super good for it was amazing and literally enjoying the service while you are there is so nice because they are really kind with you this is the typical restaurants they have we couldn't get a reservation but we saw people were there so if you can try it let me know what you think and if you want to have like fun at midnight or just like see another thing they have actually a michael jackson show while we were there it's called Taino and they also have a bar as they do in many other parts of the hotel and the show was really good like we weren't expecting much but the dancers were amazing like literally look at this it looks like michael like in real life and just enjoy a little bit of this it's really good
that is, this show isn't enough. Like literally, the hotel does like entertainment. Like this is the hotel bar that's open literally like 24/7, or at least like almost always that we were there. They have different shows every night with different kinds of music. So you have people dancing there, like like just drinking or like showing like swimming or dancing. It was super fun. And it was nice to join in. And it's another thing to do if you want. They only like want to do something right now, even if that's not going out, or you can literally just have fun at the hotel. And it's like for all ages, you can see kids, so grown ups dancing, which is really fun. If you forget something or just want to buy a souvenir for going back home, you can go to the gift shop. It has lots of things. Like we got some earrings, but you can have like some back or whatever you need for your stay there. And this is me basically just enjoying my whole stay at the hotel. It was amazing. We had an amazing time just relaxing and going around. And just as a tip, life is not that good. So if you have international roaming, it would be good. I had to work there and I had to have actually my internet, but that's good. Bye!